We only have two minutes. I'm going to talk fast, so pay attention. In Northeast Ohio, we have two varieties of wild grapes. Vitus riparia, riverbank grape. Vitus argentifolia, silverleaf grape. Vitus riparia, the riverbank grape, the leaf is green on the top and green on the underside. Vitus argentifolia, silverleaf grape, green on the top of the leaf and bluish silver on the underside, thus the name. With most, but not all, wild grapes, you get male flowers and female flowers. The female flowers need to be fertilized with pollen from the male flowers. Bees are very, very important. The vines can grow for decades and completely cover maple trees, oak trees, cherry trees, hickory trees, you name it. You name it, they'll grow over top of it. Silverleaf grapes. The birds haven't got to them yet. They're not quite ripe, although they are getting sweeter. Two weeks ago, they tasted like skunk. So three things you need to remember. Wild grape, wild hickory nut, poison ivy. Yatahe.